Okay. So where are we going to now? So I guess we could go back to this thing now that we got flares. Life pod 12, which is near the Aurora. It's dangerous, but this one seems way too deep. 300. I'd have to swim 100 meters down. It's too deep. This one is okay. This one I can manage. As long as there's no freaking monster demons guarding it, I can manage that. Let's go. So we should drive this as close as we can get to the to the life pod without damaging the ship you know we should take it down to like around 195 depth somewhere around there and get it like right above it hopefully we don't run into any leviathans but i feel like there's a high chance we will since we're going towards the aurora We'll deal with it. We'll figure out a way to deal with it. If it's just too dangerous, we'll get back in the Aurora or get back in the, um, the Seamoth and Skedaddle and go do something else. We could still just go explore in random directions and maybe we come across something helpful. I can see the shape in the water right there. Okay. So there's definitely a Leviathan there. Let's go this way. Wreckage here. These idiots. Passing one hundred meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. Oh, wait a minute. We're here. Let's look around. Oh, okay, okay. And I can't swap out to this, right? Radiation damage. What does the radiation do? I can see it building up. It can't be good. I'm losing HP. Okay, yeah. So it does what we expected. You lose HP. Okay. Can't get in there. have 45 seconds of oxygen whoa light stick fragment a light stick I don't like how wedged this in this is right here. Let's pull it out a little bit. 
Wait. I feel like this is a better hiding spot. I don't know. Coming over here. No, I don't like that. All right, let's just go. 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Can I open this hatch? No. Another one of these things? Sure. Mobile vehicle fragment. What is that sound? Sealed door. Plant pot. New blueprint acquired. Blueprint acquired. Maybe we should bring the ship right here, actually. To this side? Yeah, this side's way better. Whoa, it's lagging. Let's bring the ship around. What is that noise? Seems I already had that. Oh. seconds. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. A mobile battery powered LED light which provides low level lighting in a 360 degree area and can be attached 
Some more surfaces. Ooh. Okay, I got a lot of 21 new things I can make. Vehicle upgrades. Emoth depth module. Ooh, I can make this. All reinforcement. Engine efficiency. Storage. Yeah, yeah. Solar charge. Recharge the CMOS power cell while in the sunlight. That doesn't seem helpful. CMOS perimeter defense system. Generates a localized electric field designated to ward off aggressive fauna. Oh, yes, that one seems really helpful. CMOS torpedo. A standard payload delivery system adapted to fire torpedoes. I need something called aerogel. CMOS sonar. I need magnetite. Prawn suit. Prawn suit stuff. Prawn, prawn, vortex. Whoa. Hell yeah, dude. Modification station. Okay, here we go. Seamoth Depth Module Mark II. I need more magnetite. Okay, so with the Seamoth Depth Module Mark I, I imagine I'll be able to find magnetite. This. Okay. Sick, 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 dude. Okay, wait, maybe we should head back then. We'll finish exploring here, head back. We know there's a Leviathan in this area, right? And I can get this, a defense system, it sounds like. I can make that, right? Poly, whatever. Poly something. Polyline. Yeah, gold and hydrochloric acid. I can make that. I have access to deep shrooms. And salt, I can totally make this. Awesome. So this will protect us from what you call it. And maybe I should get this then. I don't have any other way to recharge the batteries yet. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. All reinforcement sounds very important. We definitely want that. Engine efficiency, we definitely want that. Reduces heat byproduct to minimize power and effectiveness. Yes, definitely. So these, so that's three slots right there. And then four. It has four upgrade slots, I noticed. Yeah, that's four. Hull reinforcement, the depth module, engine efficiency, and then this thing to defend ourselves. Okay, cool. Seamoth torpedo sounds amazing. And sonar also amazing. But I can't make that stuff yet. I haven't found any magnets out yet. Aerogel. Okay. I don't think I can make aerogel yet. And it says there's one more thing I can make. The vehicle upgrade console interior module. Vehicle upgrade console. Build the moon pool to upgrade docked vehicles. Oh, I need the moon pool to upgrade them. Okay. Wait, I thought there was a there was a console on the ship, no? That I can put maybe I can maybe this is one way to do it. I don't know, we'll see. We'll figure it out. Wait, what's this? Alien? Alien containment? Oh interesting. Plant stuff. Cool, cool, cool. Awesome. How much space do I have? Not a lot. Running out of oxygen. 
30 seconds. Okay, I have six bases left. Passing 100 meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. This is a dead end. No space to, to get that. Okay, I think that's everything here. 30 seconds. All right, let's get out. Okay, let's look around and see if there's anything we can scan on the exterior. So we're good on the inside of the ship. Let's look around out here now. It's daylight, we can see much more now. Awesome. So there is still more titanium scrap we can get. But I think I'm fine on titanium for the moment. I have a lot and I'm not even using it. This is all just salvage, huh? doing here sea moth fragments metal okay i'm stuck passing 100 meters oxygen efficiency decreased Okay, so let's head back. Let's see if I can make any of this stuff and install it. Or maybe if I can't install it manually, I must need that vehicle upgrade thing. We're going to try it. posters so the first thing we should look into making is the depth one
And I feel like Seamoth Solar Charger. How much? How many teeth do I need for that? One. Advanced wiring kit. Can I even make an advanced wiring kit? I can. With a computer chip, gold, and a wiring kit. Hmm. Okay, let's start with this. So I need glass and a titanium ingot. Nope, I can't make it here. I can't make it here. Hmm. Okay, so where is it listed under? It's listed under vehicle upgrades. Vehicle upgrades. I have everything I need to make it, but I can't make it in this machine. Or in the modification station. Okay. So I need something else to make this that I don't have yet. Okay. All right, I think we stick with the plan then. And we keep going to the Aurora. That's where the quests are sending me, the notices. And yeah, we, that's where we go. Let's go, hopefully we don't, we don't die. We're off. Let's see how the plants are doing down here. Whoa, okay, okay, it's looking nice. Let's plant another one of these. How big are these Gabe feathers? Pretty big. How much space are we using up in here? Four, four, four. Let's plant another one. All right, let's go. We're heading back. Good luck to us. We know there's a bad boy in this area. <laughs> Good luck to us. Let's go. Oh. Have I been to this one? I have not been to Life Pod 6. It's not on any of my 3, 17, 19, 13. Awesome. Let's check it out. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen. Do I still need radiation stuff here? Seed decreased. Yeah, okay. We still need it. Look around, make sure we're clear. There was a Leviathan. I definitely saw one. But we're, it looks like we're clear here. Integrating new PDF. someone's attention that's not a distress flare stop winding it around like that you'll catch the fuel line rip she caught the fuel line like a papiga 
Okay, here are our flares. <laughs> A med kit? Okay, I can't open it. <laughs> Anything else in here? All right, so what was the point of this? Just a little joke, a little meme, another like meme space. Let's look around out here. Maybe there's something out here. Reach your egg. 30 seconds. Oxygen. You dick. Those freaking Oxygen. tiger plants. Welcome aboard, Captain. Okay, so life pod six seems like it's just here for lulls. It's here for the lulls. Let's look around out here. Lol, 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 lol. This dude is trying to dig into the side of the mountain. There's a good amount of tiger plants in this area. Not liking that. Get out of here, freaking tiger plants. What happens if I plant a tiger plant? Is it gonna hit me? You know what? Let's try it. Maybe it'll be peaceful tiger plant. <laughs> no, there's no way. I gotta put a tiger plant there and it's gonna start attacking me. I gotta try it. A mature floor specimen will grow if planted in the right condition. I gotta put it down. If it starts attacking me, then we'll just beat it up until it's gone. All right, let's go. We're heading onwards. Oh. We're back over here. The mushroom forest. Huh. What the heck? Well, we explored around here. We know there's definitely dangerous stuff here. But... It's telling me to go that way. Whoa, what are you? Let's fix the boat. I get some of this oh i could take one of these i can eat it bulb bush sample whoa i can eat it uh oh he's full it's not attacking me Let's see if I get close to it. The only way to know is to try. It's playing boss music. Can I scan you? I can't scan it. Okay. Well, it's not attacking me. It seems peaceful. All right. Okay, it's definitely not peaceful. It's definitely not peaceful. It's attacking me now. Detecting volcanic activity and several unusual electromagnetic signatures in the region. Uh -huh. Exercise caution when diving deeper. Okay, so it's definitely not peaceful. Let's try going around. Oh, there's another wreckage here. Is this the one? No, this is different. This is definitely different. Okay, let's see if we can explore this wreckage then. Unless, does it have an opening right here? No, no, no. This is definitely a different piece of wreckage. Okay, yeah. Let's look for an opening. Oh, right here. No, not there.
Something's making noises out there. Something crashed into me. One of these sharks. Is there even any way to get into this maximum thing? Depth reached. What? Hull maximum damage depth. Imminent. Got it. Uh huh. Maximum. Oh, right here. We can get in from here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right here. Okay. I should leave the lights on. Okay. Uh, let's get the Pathfinder tool. Flashlight. Pathfinder tool. Actually, maybe I should turn the lights off. I feel like if I leave it on, the monsters can see it. Let's turn it off. Okay, so we need to get out this way. Yeah, I definitely have not been in this one yet. So there are two ways to go. There was a down section, and then there's this section over here. You have water? Sure. Okay. There's a cut section. Where did I come in from? I think it sent me through the door when I opened it. This way is where I came from. Oh, oh these outside the ship. Meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Okay. We need to get some more air. 30 seconds. So there was a door we can laser cut. There's some machines in here, but doesn't seem like anything I can do with them. Okay. And then there was a way to go down uh, like a a man a manhole. A Jeffrey's tube or whatever they're called. Okay, let's cut through this door. Where did I see that door now? Stasis rifle. Here it is. Okay. I'm losing three seconds or three oxygen per tick. So I have like 10 seconds worth of oxygen left. 10 ticks worth of oxygen. So it's like 10 seconds. Let's get out of here. This way. This way. Oxygen. Do I need the rebreather here? Yep. I mean the radiation thing, yep. Okay, I need the radiation helmet here. Okay, where was that door? Right here. All right. Let's get the Pathfinder tool back. Make sure we mark the door when we get on the other side. Okay, this is the door I came in from. Something screaming in here. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency near blueprint acquired. Cyclops upgrade. 
Engineer blueprint acquired. A battery? Integrating new PDA data. PDA data, I have 10 seconds of oxygen. 30 seconds. It's actually 10 seconds. We're losing three oxygen per tick. It is really lagging in this area. All right, let's go back and keep looking around. Something screaming out there. Doesn't sound good. Where's the door? Oh, it shut the door when I reloaded. How dare you? Okay, this leads outside. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. I don't see anything there. This was the door we cut open. Was there anything else in here? There's a door there. It's locked. Food. Yeah, that's a leviathan. That loud screeching has to be a leviathan. Oh, I'm running out of air. Okay. Is something biting my ship? Get out of here. Stop screaming and biting my ship. Okay, well, we know if anything else is screaming, it's not him. Wait, right, there's something over here. What's this? Hey, what are you? You're glowing. Come here. I can't grab him. I can't grab him. He bit my ship. I have to repair it now. What's it? What's it at? Wait, it's fine. No, it's definitely not fine. He did bite it. It's at 85. You freaking... Okay, so if there's no longer screaming, then we know the screaming was that maniac, and he's gone now. Alright. Oh, wait. Wait, that's actually kind of helpful. It's deeper that way. Makes sense. Okay. Uh, flashlight. Mm -hmm. I have a new battery here. Ooh, yeah, if I need that. For the flashlight? Cool. Alright, let's top up on oxygen. We're going to check that area I was just in one last time. And then we're going to go down the vent. There was a vent right there. One last look in this place. Go through the door here. Careful of the electricity. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. I don't think there's anything else in here. Anything in the ceiling? There's this door that I can't open. Okay, so we're gonna say check. I don't see anything else. We're gonna say this section of the ship check. We're going to reset the Pathfinder tool and then go down the Jeffrey's tube. Okay, it's quiet now. So then the screaming was him. 
Those things are so loud. They scream so much louder for their size. That's got to be intentional. To make you think it's a leviathan and it's just one of those annoying sharks. Oh. Not that way. Okay, let's mark the entrance. Make it clear to see. I may need this for this to get out. All right, let's go. Where is the door? Here. 30 seconds. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Well, this section is dangerous. Oxygen. Uh, am I dead? I think I might have made a bad turn. I think I drowned. Oh, I can't see anything. We drowned. Oh, that was a dangerous section. Okay, so we need... We need more oxygen there. Or maybe the play was just to do the rebreather and to use med kits. Okay. Well... What did I lose? So we gotta go back and get the sea moth. Did I lose any tools? We have the rebreather still. Uh, scanner, laser cutter, pathfinder, air bladder. Okay, I don't think we lost any tools. Let's check here. We lost a bunch of resources. We lost all the resources we had. That's unfortunate. Not a big deal though. The main thing I'm concerned with is did we lose tools? Scanner, repair tool, flashlight, my knife. Do I have those? Scanner, repair tool, flashlight, and knife. Scanner, repair tool, flashlight, knife. Pathfinder, air bladder, laser cutter. Okay, that's it. Pathfinder, air bladder, laser cutter. Okay, so we didn't lose any tools. Good. Yeah, so that section is... I don't think it's worth going back in there. It's too dangerous. Rock grub. Harmless. Okay. That section is too dangerous. Mm. Okay, so we need food. And then let's... Recharge the batteries. Okay, all in all, we're fine. So we do have to go back and get the, um, the sea moth. But we're heading that way anyway, so it's fine. Okay. Let's go. It's saying oxygen efficiency is decreased, but I'm still losing like three ticks. Oh, I'm losing four ticks of air now. Oh. So I'm losing four air every three seconds. Okay.
aboard, Captain. You want to take one more look? I want to take one more look. I want to take one more look. We're here now. I'm so curious what's in here. Come on. No, this is too... These turns are way too sharp. No, it's not worth... This is this is too tough to navigate. It's like the camera is so zoomed in, it's hard to see where I need to turn. And yeah. No, nah, it's not worth... Let's get out of this place. This place lags. All right, let's clear the nodes. Let's get out of this ship. So this ship lags for whatever reason. There's something wrong with it. It's lagging. Let's just get out of here. Okay, let's grab another one of these things. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Bulb bush sample. <laughs> Okay, we can look around the base at least. Maybe there's some cool stuff down here that I can scan. Whoa, speaking of which. Ooh, those things are beautiful. So the sea moth can't go any lower. Let's put the sea moth near this thing. Maximum depth reached. Child damage imminent. Oh, there's a bunch of those. I feel like those things are going to attack the ship. I think those things might be what's lagging everything in this area. Those eels. They're like, it's really laggy. Yeah, I think it's the eels lagging me. Okay, let's park it over here. Hopefully they don't attack it. All right, let's keep looking around. This is a, a wreck from the Aurora. There's got to be useful things to scan here, at least. We didn't really find anything helpful inside. There's got to be something out here. Get off of me. My primary directive is soon closer to you. What are you? It ran away. Come here. Some sort of predator fish. A mesmer. Who are you trying to mesmerize? I'll teach you a lesson. Okay, where is my ship? 30 seconds. Okay, so what did I just encounter there? A carnivore? Rock grub? The mesmer? The fish? Small carnivorous life form with a unique hunting mechanism that enables it to hypnotize its foes. Why did it hypnotize the computer? The computer was telling me to go near it. <laughs> it even hypnotized the AI. Damn, that's OP. You're OP, sir. You can even hypnotize a computer. He reprogrammed a computer. You must swim towards me. I am the Mesma. I've hacked you, and now I'm going to eat you. Okay, well... I kind of want to keep looking around the wreck. Despite that Mesmer. Passing 
This is the same stuff as always. Nothing new. Maybe I do need to go inside the Aurora to progress. Oh, what's this? Some sort of volcano? This is the volcanic activity I was warning me of. Okay, I probably shouldn't swim directly inside that. <laughs> Let's not go inside that. Oh, no, I'm running out of air again. Where's my ship? Right here. Okay. Surely there's something useful out here. Surely. I can scan something here. What can I scan? Oh, that thing? Sure. I mean, I can eat these, right? This one's going bad. Oh, whatever. I think you could still plan it, even if it's bad. <laughs> yeah, I don't know that going down to that ship is actually a good idea. Like, I can't see anything over here, and I'm running out of air so fast. And now we know there's those hypnotizing fish. Fuck it, we're gonna do it anyway. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. 30 seconds. Alright, let's just do it. Let's go do it now. Alright, so we're just gonna... Go out to above where the beacon is and then swim straight down. If I die, if the ship blows up, we can replace it. Okay, so we're going right here. Grab, 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 and get out as quickly as possible. It is lagging something awful here. Anything around the wreck? I think it's this volcano is lagging me. Okay, I don't see anything around here. Oh, that's hot. Hot, 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 hot. All right, I need to get to the ship. I'm about to drown. And there's something screaming at me. Oh, it was you. What do you want? Okay, what did I get? Can I, can you use this in here? Nope. Still can't use it. I can make something new now. I can make a repulsion cannon modification station. Applies percussive force to entities in range, but I need magnetite. Okay, so I have to, I think what I need to do now, I need to explore and find where the heck this freaking magnetite is. I'm hitting a wall, a brick wall, and I don't know what to do now. Ocean Cannon. Roar Survivors. I'm uh, not really a doctor. I know that's what my ID says, but I never have been. Cheated the medical exams. What does a doctor these days need to know about manually resetting bones? When was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? That's what the robots are for. Doctors these days read diagnoses <laughs> off of computer readouts. For that, I'm perfectly qualified. 
<laughs> but what good is it when I'm not connected to the main network? I'm bleeding. I've got glowing green pustules growing on my hands. I run a self-scan and it tells me I've got skin irritation. The only thing I studied in medical school was how to lie convincingly. <laughs> what the hell do I know about how to treat an alien disease? I think I'm actually going to die down here. <laughs> okay. Well, it looks like he did. All right. So what were those other life pods? Maybe we can go to one of the other life pods. Although I went to one and it was a meme. Oh, fucking being trolled. Uh, I haven't been to four, six. No, I did find six. We found six. Yeah, we found six on the way to this location. I haven't been here yet or four. Where's four? Four looks like it's above the water. A distress signal has been reached from life pod four, but attached to the coordinates. Flotation devices active. Life pod located at sea level. Pod is in close proximity to radioactive fallout from the aura. Transmission Oregon ran. 150 meters northwest of the Aurora's port midsection. Okay, I don't know what that means. But this looks like the engines. So towards the middle on the surface of the ocean, we should see life pod 4. Okay, let's go there then. Am I in the ship? No. So let's go up. I lost your ability going up. Okay. 